I'm Dinul. I study mechanical engineering at the University of Greenwich at Metve. I'm a final year student who progressed on to make a disruptive mechanism of global business in order to democratize air conditioning. It did spring out of my final year project that was started to reduce carbon emissions uh, from the UN global emissions pie chart. The enterprise challenge at the University of Greenwich housed a cross-campus competition that would incorporate social, business, engineering and all kinds of other aspects including financial technologies and further developments in any sort of business criteria. I was privileged enough to come runners-up and win the engineers in business category where students could win multiple arrangements of awards which would be specific to each and every category of business or entity. And this uh, avenue uh, led me to the other technological breakthrough that could one day revolutionize renewable energy and concentrated solar power to be specific for the betterment of the world. Hello, I am Bruno and I'm a final year student at the University of Greenwich and I'm studying Mechanical Engineering. I applied to the University of Greenwich through Clearing and due to my circumstances at the time I felt like this was the moment for change when I actually felt I was being heard and, and cared for and they listened to my, uh, to my own circumstances, they tailored a path for me and they helped me engage and they provided me with the support to move forward in my life. And I feel like, you know, this was very valuable. The first time I heard mechanical engineering was when my mom just watched me playing with toys, breaking them, and she said, oh, why are you breaking your toys? And I said, I just want to learn how to reassemble them. And then she said, I might as well become a mechanical engineer. I'm like, oh, is that, am I going to be, am I going to get to break toys all the time then as mechanical engineer? And she said, no, 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 it's not what there is to it. But I, as, a, as, a, as an adult, I learned that, you know, just the process of design, selecting materials, understanding new methodologies of how to develop a solution for problems. That inspired me to follow this path because it's broad and it's just like there's a lot of options involved. And I saw that just learning the key methodologies for design and uh, solution like problem solving can get me there. So that is the main ambition as a mechanical engineer. At the University of Greenwich, I was able to explore different projects such as the Engineers Without Borders where we uh, provided projects for the South Africa to try to help redu to reduce the load on the grid and we made we made it as a grand finalist there. And in the Enterprise Challenge, we had a project called TXP where we tried to help doctors with uh, my medical imaging through the use of deep learning. I hope people learn the same thing I learned. So once you push yourself outside of the comfort zone, you can learn new things. And that experience in itself is priceless. My name is Akim. Adeniji. I'm a student of mechanical engineering in the University of Greenwich, Medway Campus. Here is my project, design and manufacture of polymer test rig. This machine is responsible for measuring the wear rates of any type of plastic gears. In the next few decades, there will be elimination of metal gears and will be replaced with plastic gears. But the plastic gears has a significant problem, which is reduction in weight. That is wear rate. It will wear faster because of its light weight. Thus, this machine is responsible to measure the wear rate to be able to give the probable time maximum wear we occur on the plastic gear for it to be replaced to prevent mechanical failure or mechanical damage on the machine. That is why this polymer test rig is built. It's been incorporated. The machine is built as a result of the support from University of Greenwich. High qualified teachers has made me to realize and manufacture this particular machine. It is a dream, but now it has been realized to manufacture a polymer test rig, which will have a positive contribution in the Industrial Revolution.